Hey guys, Shauna here and welcome to Vlogmas Day 1. I have been like preparing myself for Vlogmas literally since Thanksgiving and so here we are. Today is December 1st. I got my Santa mug here. As you guys saw, I did the um, Nespresso Advent Calendar for today and it was the Columbia roast which i actually like it's strong but i do enjoy it so i just added some vanilla and cinnamon to it tastes really really good so that's what i'm having for my morning coffee we do have some other advent calendars that we're going to get into later if you're new here um, i have an eight-year-old and i have a 15 month old and the eight-year-old was so eager to get to his advent calendar this morning he's already opened his bath bomb and his his book he read one page of the book and then he said he'll read the rest later when he gets home from school so there's that but yeah we'll do the rest later i got a candle advent calendar a new one that i'm so excited to share with you guys i went a totally different route last year i did the veluspa 12 days of christmas advent calendar and this year i did the apotheke uh, 12 days advent calendar candle set that they have and it's super cute so i'm excited to share that with you guys too we also got the dog an advent calendar as well so this is going to be like a family affair here so yeah just lots of fun stuff Sefton actually um, gave me a list of festive things he would like to do during vlogmas so I've just been going through getting tickets for different things because like he's serious about a few of these things so I wanted to make sure that I got tickets for that so that's exciting and yeah today is extremely cold it's like 18 degrees so I'm not sure how much stuff we're going to be doing outside today but um, I do need to run out and just do a few errands nothing too major so I'll bring you guys along with me for that but yeah I'm so excited as you guys can tell like I'm like the coffee has kicked in clearly so I'm like amped up I need to make PJ's breakfast now and kind of plan out the rest of the day it's not a hectic day but I just need to you know plan out things that I need to do once we get going and get out of the house I will come back and yeah we'll go from there so yeah I'm excited guys I hope you are too cheers to vlogmas 2022 guys so i'm back i just put pj down for a nap well not just but he's been down for about 20 minutes it's 11 47 yes i'm still in pajamas but these are loungewear for me like i don't sleep in these these are just my like loungewear 
little set and it's so comfortable like i want to order some more i think they have some on sale on nordstrom last time i checked this one unfortunately is not on sale but they had some other print printed ones that were on sale so i may check that out but it's so comfortable i think target even has sets like this too anywho um i figured i would come back because I did do some changes to decor, which you guys will see that a lot here, just because I will literally just be standing here and decide to change something. So if you see things different <laughs> throughout this month, just know that, you know, I just like to switch things up. The tree, however, is it is what it is. Um, I do want to find a couple like sentimental uh, ornaments this year, like for PJ and Seth. But, um, yeah, we even had to remove the ornaments from the bottom of the tree because we got a toddler who has been, like, removing them constantly. So we just took them off. So the tree is, like, decor <laughs> decorated, like, from midway up. The star is crooked. I'm going to have PK adjust the star for me when he gets home because it's a little wonky looking. But if you guys remember in my last vlog when I was in Crate and Barrel, or was that CB2? CB2, I shared some little trees with you guys in the store. But I didn't haul them in that video because I wanted to save them for this video so I have those up here now I do need to switch out my like florals here because these are still the florals from Thanksgiving so I need to switch that out so and then I put up our advent calendar that I always hold on let me just show you. so I put up our little Christmas calendar that I put up every year I got this from Target several years ago so I put the little Christmas tree candle that I got from H&M right there okay so I put that right there and I think I want to start like burning this every day um, until Christmas so um, I just have that right there and then I put the lighthouses up here on the oven not sure if I'm gonna keep them here but one of the lights is out so I need to replace that but it's just there here are the newest little decor pieces that I got this one I've had for several years this is actually from Target um, I got that a couple years ago then I just put our other calendar right here on the front of the refrigerator here's how this looks and I hate that that light is out because it looks pretty at night when everything is lit up when I have this one lit and you know all of them are lit up but yeah, I'm just gonna sit here and finish editing that's that's what I'm doing just chilling watching the crown and editing and I think for dinner I'm gonna do a turkey meatloaf and maybe like some peas and mashed potatoes maybe um, I don't know I've just been in a comfort food mood lately uh, since I made the Popeye I've just been like ooh, comfort food like this is just the time of the year where you just want all the comfort food, you know? I'm gonna do a healthy-ish meatloaf. <laughs> I'm gonna use ground turkey though, so. Uh, I pretty much have all of the ingredients in the fridge, so I don't need to go to the grocery store to get anything. Um, so yeah, that will be dinner, so I'll obviously share that with you guys as well. And yeah, that's it. See what else we get into throughout the day.
Alright guys, so I just got back from running my errands and I wanted to show you guys what I got. I mentioned these in my video that I did when I got the Yvette Sport, the Yvette Sport haul. I'll leave that video link below for you guys. But I had mentioned that um, I wanted to get a new pair of running shoes and I couldn't remember the name of them at the time. <laughs> but um, a few of you in the comments had mentioned it and I was like yeah so the brand is on and I ordered them on Nordstrom for in-store pickup and so that's what I was going in for just to pick them up because like I said in that video PK wears these when he runs and he raves about them and so he was like you gotta get a pair you gotta get a pair I went online my store had them in stock but i wasn't sure about the sizing so i ordered an eight online um and when i got there i was just like i'll just try them on when i get in the store so when i got there i tried on the eight and it was it fit but it was a little too tight so i went up to uh eight and a half and they fit perfect so i want to show you guys i just went with the all black just because i figured these will go with all of my workout clothes like they have so many different colors and variations of this shoe but I just went with the black and these are the cloud x3 and yeah so these are my new running shoes and I'm so excited to try them out it's so funny because PK is getting ready to go run now and I'm like uh I want to go when you get back so we'll see maybe I'll go work out later um once I'm done cooking dinner but yeah I just wanted to share these with you guys I will definitely keep you posted but a couple of you mentioned these and the hakas and definitely i'm not a fan of the hakas although i know they are super super popular i just don't like the look of them the sole is just too thick for me um but these are so light like feels like nothing on your feet so i am like so motivated now and so excited to start running and yeah also someone has suggested that i start doing pilates i am definitely going to try to find a pilates studio um, near me that I can start doing Pilates classes. I want to take it slow. I'm definitely going to have to start out in the beginners because I haven't done Pilates in over 10 years. And I responded to the young lady who had made that comment. I told her like, you know, I do remember when I did Pilates, how my core was so strong and I forgot that feeling until she mentioned it. And so um, she mentioned that and yoga. I'm not a big fan of yoga, but Pilates I can definitely get with. So I am going to start researching Pilates studios to see if I can find one near me. So I'll keep you guys posted on that, but I'm definitely excited to start running. And these are good for training and running. So yeah, you know, they're not the fanciest looking shoe but it's not about that for me at this point it's just about having a good pair of running shoes that feel good and i'm telling you guys if if you guys are runners you know this but the shoe does make a difference it really really does so those are my new running shoes i can't wait to try them out so i am getting ready to start dinner yeah i will let you guys watch and then I will come back when we are ready to do the advent calendars. All right.
right guys so we just finished dinner now we are getting ready to do the rest of our advent calendars or Sefton wanted to show you guys his bath bomb for today um it's blueberry uh smell. blueberry who it smells like blueberries. oh he says it smells like blueberries so that is his bath bomb for day one. Oh yeah he got some little tag for you guys very scented yeah okay and then for his book for the day go ahead grab it great space expectation are you gonna read that I, you go I, I read it some of them yeah you read it a little bit of this morning i read this all right and then pj's book Whoa. Mickey's Christmas Memories. So I will read this to PJ tonight after I give him his bath and get him down for bed. And yeah, so that is PJ's story for the day. Can you put that back for me? Mm -hmm. Now we're gonna do the chocolates and then we'll let PK do Solo's Dog Treat Advent Calendar. <laughs> All right, you want to do yours first? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, one. Yep. How do you get it out? Is it going to pop it out? What is it, a bear? Aw, cute. What'd you get? Okay. Let's see. Where is. All right, number one is right here. It's supposed to be dark chocolate? Yes, I love dark chocolate. I kind of like this. Oh, it says it has a little saying in there. It says, mm -hmm. women cocoa farmers do a lot of the fermenting and drying, which make the chocolate taste so delicious. Oh, nice. Where's the chocolate, though? Oh, it's a heart. Oh, cute. It's a heart. Mm. So good. You want to eat sure? <laughs> Alright, put these back. So we are going to do Solo's advent calendar now and PK is going to do the honors for us. Right. Who took the box <laughs> up with your big bear paws? Goodness. Let me see. <laughs> okay, so here is this tree. Does it say what? No, it doesn't say giving it. Oh gosh, I'm gonna have to tape that up. Goodness. <laughs> He's like, Isn't that so good? It's peanut butter. Yeah, he'll clean it up. <laughs> well, it's safe to say he liked it. Thank you so long for your participation. I appreciate it. <laughs> All right, guys. Now we are going to do the candle advent calendar. And we're going to let Mr. Sefton do the honors. They also gave us matches, too, which is really nice. So, you want to come and do the candle? Days. Okay. It's one. The first one. This one? Yeah. So, day one is charred fig. And here's the description it says, wild fig leaf and crisp amber are combined with hints of neroli and cashmere woods to create an earthy yet sweet fragrance. Yeah. 
okay. It's okay. Yeah, it's okay. It don't have a good smell. It's it looks pretty. The color is pretty. I like this little tin. It's okay. Oh, it smells good. It's just it's okay. It's, Okay. I, you barely so, can smell it. You must be stuffy, because I can really smell it. Okay. Well, let's light it and see. Alright guys, so that is going to do it for Vlogmas Day 1. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you on Day 2. Bye! Bye.